The Dogon are another people who have their own solutions to the problems of an inhospitable environment. They cultivate millet but specialize in growing onions which they sell to their neighbors as well as storing for themselves. Their farming requires a laborious process of irrigation. During the dry season, most of the year, water has to be stored in cisterns. Artificial terraces have had to be carved from the foot of the escarpment. And to irrigate this crop, relays of women have to act as a kind of human aqueduct. The labor is immense, but all over Africa, and not only among the Dogon, the drudgery of farming has always fallen to women. In common with other African peoples, the Dogon have evolved a complex system of beliefs about the creation and working of the world. And these beliefs are central to the ordering of their daily lives. Decorated with the four-armed cross of Amma, of God the Creator, a Dogon granary is conceived as a model of the universe. Door carvings depict the eight original ancestors and other figures from Dogon religion, including those that refer to divination, the foretelling of the future by the fox, the agent of misfortune. Divination among the Dogon is the work of trained soothsayers. The diviners draw intersecting lines in the sand as a prelude to interpreting the tracks which a fox will make. The interpretation of the tracks has its own logic. Like Christians, the Dogon believe that God withdrew to heaven when man offended against his law, but the agent of evil in Dogon belief was not the serpent of the Garden of Eden, but the fox. Attracted by a bait of peanuts arranged in a particular pattern, the fox will predict the future with its footprints. The fox which brought misfortune can also foretell misfortune. Soon after dawn, the diviners come to see where the fox has walked in the night. By examining the tracks of its prints, they can learn the shape of things to come. They will have advice for individual applicants, or perhaps for the whole village. And if they're thought to be good, says, clients will take their advice and will pay for it. <laughs> 